Now that you've created your image with the three different layers and um, you're looking at it and you say, oh, I'd really like to crop out part of the background and uh, maybe get rid of this tree over here and some of the grass. Um, how would you do that? Most people would think that you would be able to go ahead and deselect the top two layers and then go to the rectangular selection tool and draw a rectangle around the area that you want and then go ahead and hit crop to selection and it takes a second for it to process but once it's processed you would think that you could just turn on your layers and everything would be great but what you'll find out is that the way paint.net works is even though you've deselected those two layers it's actually cropped all three layers so let's go ahead and discard that and start over again. So how does it work? What you would actually do is you would go ahead and deselect the top two layers, go to the rectangle select tool, select the area that you want, go to edit, invert selection, and then I use the delete key to delete the part that um, that was selected so this is the part that I want to keep then I will draw a rectangle and select this again whoops let me do that again alright so I've selected that then I'm going to come up to the move selected pixels and then size it to fit the entire there you go size it appropriately now when you turn on the layers you'll see you have exactly what you wanted the tree is gone and a lot of the grass has gone but the person and the ball remain the same as before so that is how you um, crop, I guess, uh, just one of your multiple layers.